Welcome everybody. Um, I'm Nigel Williams. I'm the president of Cetasic for my sins. And I'm also the managing partner of Royalton Partners, which manages the fund which controls um, Cetasic. Um, I'm very happy to welcome you all here this evening. It's nice to see so many familiar faces. We normally meet on the rooftops of uh, Bucharest, but tonight the weather forecast thought that uh, rain might happen. And my chief risk officer is here, Alex, and he told me it's too risky uh, and we don't want to have an insurance claim, so we better not do the party on the roof. So I listened to Alex. He's controlling my life. Between the lawyers and the risk officer, one really can't do anything these days. Um, we're very happy with the development in Cetasic, and what I really wanted to say is, what a difference in a year. For those of you that were here last year, at this time, Cetasic was a completely different company. It was a company fitting in with the rest of the Romanian market, doing 55% motor. That is no longer the case. James here, together with Mihai and Michaela, have completely re-engineered Cetasic over the last 12 months. Today we have a company offering specialist insurance solutions, properly analyzing risk, and offering those products that clients need. I think it's fantastic that I think we're number seven in liability, something like that today, so, uh, in this market, which is where we want it to be. I think somebody asked me, am I happy with the development of Cetasic? I'm incredibly happy with the development of Cetasic. I think the team have done a great job, and that's important. But the second thing is that Cetasic's strategy is to be a corporate insurer. We're not interested in the mass retail market. And we decided to distribute through brokers. So you are our partners, not our competitors. No way from Cetasic is going to go in and try and take a client from you. We want to work with you, and we want to build our business in partnership with the brokerage community here in Bucharest and in Romania. And that's a very important message, because some of the other insurance companies, sure, but they have agents, they have their own people, they're trying to compete with you. That's not going to happen with Cetasic. We're here to work with you in partnership, and we have worked together to produce what has been a fantastic result. A little bit of housekeeping news on my part. We're very happy that uh, Michaela Kochikano is now an approved board member, and Mihai Blajan is deputy general manager. Those are announcements that we're happy to make formally now that they've been officially approved. And I think the last thing I want to say is I think really, as you all know, we hope the Romanian economy is now going to improve. I mean, we used to have, going back into 06, 07, insurance was growing at 23% a year in Romania. Let us not forget, this is the least insured country in the European community. That is still the case. <coughs> and in the next 10, 15 years, that's going to change. Insurance as a percentage of GDP will go up. And those of you in the brokerage community, and those of us in the insurance underwriting community, will benefit from that. And we look forward to benefiting with that growth together with you. Well, good evening, ladies and, ladies and gentlemen. I shall speak in English because I spoke at the Christmas party in Romanian. And I uh, heard a number of people chuckle and laugh. And certainly they did not understand me, so I apologize. Um, Nigel, thank you for your kind words. Um, it's true that we made a lot of changes in 2010. Um, we've made uh, a lot of progress in that year. And what's very interesting to, to note is that the evolution of our insurance portfolio has changed uh, and adapted dramatically. In 2009, I think Nigel mentioned, more than 50% of our business was motor. Uh, motor casco business, 52%, 55%, a large, large uh, proportion. For the first quarter of 2011, it reduced to 14 or 15%. At the same time, the non-motor classes increased dramatically. Uh, for example, in 2009, we didn't underwrite any bond insurance. In 2009, it was maybe 5 or 6%. And for the first quarter of 2011, it was uh, 8, maybe 9% of our business. So this is a positive uh, change. Other classes of business that we've, we've, uh, we've adapted and changed are, for example, personal accident, cargo, marine, liabilities. Um, liability, for example, Nigel mentioned too. Um, in 2009, the percentage of the portfolio is perhaps 4, maybe 5%. Uh, in 2010, it went up to 10, 11, 12%. 
and now it's 17 percent so it's re we're one of the market leaders um, so we're very proud of the progress that's a few that was a few words on the, the portfolio in terms of insurance the other changes in terms of our team I, I have a fantastic team and I, I really think that the changes are down to them um, so this evening I would like to, to thank the about 20 of my colleagues scattered and dispersed about the room so please take a chance to, to meet those those colleagues um, and, I, and I thank you personally um, one of the main reasons for this evening though is, is not to thank my my colleagues rather to thank you the brokers and our business partners uh, not just for coming this evening but your support and patience during 2010 for your continued support for the first quarter of this year and your future support that I know we at Chertesley can count on for, for the remaining uh, 2011.